Hi guys, this is Hafiz and welcome to my channel. I'm making this video in response of some comments that I'm getting on my old video. Here is that my old video which is how to send email using PHP Mailer and Gmail SMTP. Um, in order to send email using Gmail SMTP server, you have to enable one option called less secure app access. But now this option is disabled by Google. Let me show you what people are complaining also. If I sort my comments newest first so you will see there is one comment they don't let me turn on the gmail thing it says that the option is not available anymore what should i do another person is saying less secure app access not working anymore in gmail so let's see if i come here in my gmail settings how i came here simply after you log in with your gmail account you have to click here on your uh, profile icon and then click manage your google account once you click on this one you will reach here in the home area and then you have to click on security okay if I come down here at bottom you will see that less secure app access option is still there but at last you can read this setting is no longer available so it means they disabled this option we, we cannot enable it anymore so what is the solution we can use another option which is app password so uh, to enable that option first we have to enable two-step verification so let's enable this first i'll click on two-step verification and click on get started here it is asking my uh, gmail password which is already saved in this browser so i'll click next my phone is already attached with this account so it is showing my iphone so i'll just continue here i have to provide my mobile number to get security code from google so I have two options here. I can either uh, receive one text message or receive a phone call. So I will uh, say send me a text message. So I'll click send. And now I will enter the text message whatever I received on my Google account. So I have entered the code what I received as SMS. I'll click next. After entering the code I got the option turn on two step verification. So I will click on turn on. And now if I go back to uh, manage your Google account and then click on security again here you can see I got one option app passwords so what I have to do I will click on this option it will again ask password of my account I'll enter the password and click next and then here uh, it is asking select the app and device you want to generate the password for so I'll click on this drop down and click on other and I will give my custom app name which is PHP mailer okay you can give any name you want okay I will click generate I will simply copy this password and open my notepad and keep this password here in my notepad and that's all we just need to generate the password for our PHP mailer app now instead of using your Gmail account password you can simply replace that password with this app password which we got here in uh, app password option now I can use this password in my PHP mailer app so let me use same old code which I used in my old video uh, you can see here download source so I will click here so here is the link for source code I will download let me open this zip file I will drag this folder and bring it to my stdocs folder okay and then here is my uh, code editor sublime text code editor I will drag this folder and open this folder inside my sublime text so if I open this index.php you can see my previous code so what we have to do we have to provide our gmail account which is growexperts at gmail.com and this is the same account where we just generated the password for this app now I need to provide the password that same password which I got after enabling app password option 
okay i will provide this password here i'll paste this password i will keep the subject of email test email using php mailer and then here i need to provide sender email you can see here the command set sender email i will provide same email which is bro experts at gmail.com and then here is one attachment also for now i will close the attachment and uh, um, now here i need to provide who will receive this email so i will send email on the same email which is bro experts at gmail.com and uh, i will remove this okay and save this code now let's try to send email we have updated our email and the password that we got from a password option remember this is not the password of this account this is that separate password that we have generated through a password option uh, inside our gmail account so let me browse this file where is this file if i see the location of this file this file is here inside my docs and php mailer and inside that index.php so let me browse this file now the question is what will happen if i open this file if i open this file this code will send one simple text email uh, the subject of the email will be test email using php mailer and there will be one h1 heading inside the body of that email you can see the email body is set here which is h1 tag and then there is line break and then there is one paragraph tag so i should receive two things in my email uh, one heading and one paragraph so let me hit this file which is on this location local host slash php mailer slash index dot php enter you can see it's taking some time it seems the code is working it's trying to access uh, php mailer and trying to send the email yes you can see i receive this message uh, email sent okay now let's verify this if i really got email or not okay i will open my gmail account can see i got one email which is test email using php mailer um, if i open this email you can see i just got this email zero minute ago so email body is exactly the same what was inside that file uh, which is this is html h1 heading and this is html paragraph 